Okay, Ryan and Danny from No Review Playthrough. Today we've got Valeria Card Kingdoms we're going to play. Um, one nice thing about the challenge, we're trying to do a bunch of games we have not played in a while. And we pull this one out every once in a while and play through that. We obviously have quite a few things upgraded. We're going to be using poker chips instead of the wooden chips, wooden pieces they come with. While they're really good pieces, they're really good wooden pieces. Yeah, I don't think you've ever even seen these, no, have you? So they have wooden for gold. They're really nice, but I need I just, to think about them not coming yeah, with these oh, nice. Yeah, you, chips. you've always played with the poker chips. Yeah, I found these poker chips, and they actually match the colors. Mm. So here's the magic. They match the colors like perfect. Yeah, they're different shapes too. Yeah, and they're different shapes. So we've up, I upgraded those because the, like I played a game or two with the wooden tokens, and it just seems like you're constantly, you're constantly getting them, giving them out, and it's just kind of a pain. So yeah. I found a deal. Uh, I think it was a Walmart. I got these a hundred chips. So I have a, so we have a whole bunch of stacks of them. So we have the red for the, so this is magic. We have gold, and then we have red for the military. So I've upgraded the poker chips. Um, we have the Agents expansion. That This allows us to, we can do whatever this is. We just take the agent, do the conversions, put it underneath here. Um, and then I have, I do have upgraded Peasants and Knights from the base game. And then we play, instead of taking a random ones, twos, threes, there's two ones, two twos, two, two of each number except the fives and sixes. Um, what I like to do is I shuffle these up. So these are all the ones and twoses, ones and twoses, all the ones and twos. So we don't know if we're going to get a monk or a cleric and we just shuffle these up and reveal the top one. So it is a little bit more random. And instead of just randomly, I do randomly pick the monsters though, out of the, uh, five or uh, we got five there. There's probably about 10 monster groups. I just do randomly grab the monster group as we go from there. Um, so if you've never played this, it's very similar to Machi Koro World. The active person rolls two dice, and we basically um, match up with that, and we take the resources and just go through. We go through until there are two stacks, or no, four stacks gone. And these cards here just remind us which stacks are gone. Actually, I forgot to give us our starting knight. I was going to say that. And a starting peasant. There's a wooden chip. Yeah, so all these wooden bits are really good. I just felt they're kind of small to be moving around all the time, so I end up getting these poker chips. So there's a starting peasant for you and a starting knight. So we start with fives and sixes, and it's basically just resource management. We try and go, and then at the end we get the most points. We have a secret duke that has... Uh, objectives like some dukes give us more points so we're trying to get points on these cards and at the end whoever's got the most points is the winner from there so that's what I'm gonna do with this dude okay so we'll go ahead and just roll the goes first I got 11 that's six, five. Five. okay so again we roll th the active person rolls the dice all right, and so we look at each number, we look at our cards. So if we had a one, we could activate the one. And again, it's the left is if you're the active player and if the right is if you're not. So you always get something. So we roll a one, neither of us have ones, neither of us have twos. And then we add together, is it three? Do we add them together or is it? We it's, add. Okay, we add them together. It's not a 12, okay. So we have three, since nothing came up, um, we each gain one resource that we our choice. I don't know. I think I don't think that's ever really come up. Yeah, it very rarely comes up. I believe we each get a resource of our choice. Uh, we're in the roll phase. Roll two dice, each die. The, each die value in the sum of both dice. Okay, so it was a three. Uh, I, what does it say? 
think we each got one. I know that it happens very rarely, but I know if we roll a one or nothing or we don't. Okay, there it is in red. Okay. Uh, take any one resource. I just want to make sure we weren't taking too much. All right, so magic is the best resource because I can pair any magic with anything else and turn it into that. Okay, so now it's my turn. I get to do two buys. So I have, I have basically four gold because I could turn these magics into gold. And the price is here in the corner. Oh, what was I doing? I already forgot. Okay, those. So I'm going to buy... Yeah, shut up, I know. Okay, so this is a three. Now this has three plus, since I already have a peasant, I do have to pay three plus one for each peasant. So I'm gonna turn in one magic, and then, well, I have to turn in everything. Yeah. I have to turn in everything. All right, so I get an upgrade peasant. Now, if I roll fives, both of my peasants will give me something, depending on the on if it's my turn or Danny's turn. Um, since I cannot buy a second thing, then for my second turn, the harvest phase, I can take any one resource that I want for my second. Okay, go ahead. Hopefully. Okay. Do I have a one? Still no ones. Sixes, okay. So the, so we look, since it's Danny's turn, she gets a one, the knight is the same on either side for us. So we both gain military and, then and we seven. added it for seven, so none of us have seven. So I'm at at least four. So I think I'll spend three to get the cleric. And I have one fight. One fight. Yeah, it's not gonna get me anything. No, won't be any defeat any monsters, no. You can't really buy anything for one either, so. No, well, uh, yeah. Well, the miners for one, yeah, 11 and 12. Sure. Well, do you know what you're? Yes. Okay, do. all right. And there's really, I mean, it's, I mean, if I knew what she was going for, I mean, you know, different symbols, and each duke that we have wants different symbols and different points. It's not a huge deal if I was to find out. Ooh, she wanted hammers. All right, so you're done. All right. Okay, so three, nothing for us. Five, since I have um, two peasants, I will get my one peasant that's upgraded as a fight or a gold. And then the other one's a gold. So I'm going to take a gold, and I think I'll take a fight for my second one. And then you get a gold. Oh, you, I got it. Oh, you did? Yeah. Okay. And then eight. Another of us have eight. Yeah. Okay, so two things. So let's go ahead. I'm going to take my two, defeat the skeleton, which has victory points on it. Plus, I get the bonus, so I'm going to get a gold for that. That's all the monsters do is give us an immediate bonus and then points in the end. Now, the reason why I did that is so that I have a gold for this. You can do anything in any order. Um... And this is basically the fantasy version of Machi Koro. Danny's never played that. I've played it once. Machi Koro is basically cities. Oh. You, there's like a, a bread farm and then a woodland, and you're basically doing the same thing. Yeah. They got, these guys literally ripped them off just with a the fantasy theme. Okay, so I have two, technically three gold. Um... The wizard's good. He's expensive. He's always expensive. Um, I'm going to buy two for a champion. I'll buy this eight champion. And so you could literally buy one of every number. And some people, Danny likes to buy one of every number, so she always gets something. But if you stack up the right numbers, you can get some massive combos on this. Yeah. Um, so I fought and bought. Fought and bought. Okay. All right, six. six. We both get red. Military. Two. 
No twos for me. And then eight. Oh, welcome, champion. So for me, oh, converted gold into four military. I have to pay him. I can't pay him, so he's not going to fight for me. Dang it. Okay. Spent all my money just to buy his loyalty. Now he won't fight for me. No, I don't have any money, basically. Well, you could do what I did. Oh, yeah. Sometimes it's easy to forget that you can fight. And then do something. And then do something after, yeah. And these progressively dig through. So you, so I might not want to do this because I, I pay two, but then she could buy pay five. So sometimes yeah. you reveal the stronger ones underneath. It's like kind of a hard to decide when to do what. It's not many for two. No. Nope. I think. Maybe that's why the warlord's so cheap. Oh, when, oh, you have the warlord. I had the champion for eight. So the warlord's up now. I think I'll get... Mm -hmm. I'll get the thief for two. Okay. Go ahead and uncover. Uh, two, three, and five. So it's my turn. I will take my fighting peasant. I'll get a money from one and a red from another. Okay, so I think I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to fight that skeleton again which will give me a gold and as you can see you're transferring these things a lot so the i think the poker chips if were a little bit easier but they're definitely an extra luxury um so i need to buy maybe a low number is it the cleric that's like a ton of magic on your yeah. turn like three magic yeah okay so i miss uh, if i spend everything then what if the eight comes up again what can i buy for two Another warlord or a thief. There's a priestess. A priestess is a nine ten. Yeah, I don't need I don't need holy symbols though. So um, I'll buy a thief. It's seven. These are only thieves in seven. No, there's two of there's two two characters in each number. Uh -huh. Um. There's the rogue. Oh, you never yeah. really buy sevens. Yeah, and they're each slightly different. Okay. Oh, wait, no, I needed to spend one of my magic so I have a gold. Okay, all right, your turn. Okay. Did I do two things? Yeah, I fought, fought a monster. Okay. I don't have anything. Five again. All right, since it's Danny's turn, I do not get military. I only get gold for my peasants. Four, five, nine. Four, five, and nine. Oh, if I'd bought the priestess. I'm not getting anything. Yeah, you're, so you get a resource of your choice. Oh. You always get you always get something. Have you skipped a few? Maybe, yeah. Uh two, three, eight's been pretty common, I guess. Let's get that. And one fight. So if you can't, you can take a resource then for your second. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Five again. So I'll take one coin from my one and a fight or military for the other. Um, four. Did you buy a four? No, you didn't buy four. And then nine. There's the priestess again, maybe. Okay. All right, so I got one. Man. I haven't even looked at these. These are kind of like higher once you get a bunch of stacks of yeah. stuff. I mean, 10 magic for five victory points, 10 gold for five victory points. So, a lot of them are just, are all of them just straight victory points? Pretty much. Um, or some of them give you a slight advantage. And then these domains, they do give you a per turn or an immediate bonus, but again, they're very high cost. So, you got to build up your resources first. Um, yeah, I think it's time. Okay, so I'll spend three and get a number one monk or cleric, which hasn't paid off for you yet. So. No. Um, second thing, I have one fight too. I will take a magic for my second mm -hmm. item. Okay. 
Oh, nice. There. Oh, but I only get one magic on your turn. You get like three. Yeah. Nice. And then three. Three and then four. Oh, man. Yeah. Okay. Need a one through four numbers. Need one through 12. Gonna... Oh, I wasn't supposed to buy the cleric. That's not my. I don't need holy guys. Oh well. I'm gonna use three to get a two for blacksmith. And I guess one can't use my last to get three. Okay. All right. Okay, two. You just got a two. Gold. So blacksmith gives you gold. Yeah. Six, we both get military. And then eight. Nice. So on my turn, I get four military for my champion. Nice. Still don't get one. It's one for each knight. Oh, um, yeah, so you need, yeah, you wanna. Okay, <clears throat> so let's do some fighting then. What can I get for fighting? I got two. Four, six, technically seven, eight, if I pair it up with that. So these are a, these are a combination of magic and fighting. Um, let's fight this kobold. One, two, three, four, five. So one magic, five military. So I'm gonna fight the kobold, that's three victories. But I get two gold back and a magic. This has the plus symbol, so I get both. Yeah. It has the, what slash. is it, just the slash between yeah. it, you have to choose. Okay, I need to buy some citizens. Um, I do have a thief, I got a seven, eight. Um, you know what, we've had five come up quite a bit. Yeah. Yeah. Already have so five. I have to pay, so it's three, and I have two peasants already, so I gotta pay five. So it's gonna take all my gold and all my magic. But now I get three citizens if I get a five. Mm. It's pretty nice. Or peasant. All right, your turn. Yeah, I did too. Yeah, I fought the kobold send. Ah, six. Six have come up a lot. Five. Oh, well, it's your turn. Yeah. I only get th only three. And then 11? Oh. Then 11. Oh, wait, no, it's my turn. Yeah, you've got the minor for 11. Oh. It's one plus one for each domain. Oh, yeah. Okay. <coughs> so, got four fight. Five. Uh, I don't have any magic. Yeah, the tree and, or the owl bear is the only thing you can. Well, did you say five or four? Four. Oh. Yeah, you can only do the tree and or the owl bear. With no magic. Do the treant. Okay, so you get one of each. Gold and magic. And then... For money... I need a four. You have five if you count your gold. Or your magic. So I'll do four... Or three gold and then magic for that. Wizard, okay. All right, so there's the four archer. Yeah, I don't know why the number fours are so expensive. All right, fives. Ooh, so for me, I'm going to take my two fighting peasants and my one gold. You just bought a four. Yeah. And then a nine. Nine's come up quite a bit. Okay. Um, man, I could use some magic. Um, let's see, so let's take my four military, let's fight the owlbear, I'll get two magic in return. Uh, these numbers are paying off, but I think I need to diversify. one magic which is four and I'll get an archer as well okay all I need is 
We haven't had any really big uh, ones. One magic for me. Oh, is it my turn? Yes. Yep. Yep, so you get three magic. Military is six for the knights. Seven. And then seven. Ooh. So on your turn, I can take two gold or two magic. Uh, I can take magic yeah. from you. Okay, so I'm taking gold then. So it says, yeah, it says three three magic for me or three from three gold from the bank. Yeah. I only have two magic, so you might as well take three gold from I'm not I did, oh, yeah. okay. Just because you'd be one down. Yeah. So I'm gonna. You're gonna big stash. One of you each to get my last number. Okay. And then I have to get five. You pair up your magic. Fighting. So that's a total of one magic and four fight, which you can use the, as long as you have one magic, and then you can. As long as you have one of each color, you can always pair the rest with magic. So that's technically six resources. This would be, no, five resources. This would be six resources. Yeah, so I can't get that one. Um, reward still not very good. No, not yet. So I'll do the owl bear. Get the two magic back. Not a... You bought a citizen, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay, one is three magic for me, for the cleric. I do not have a two. I do not have a three. Yeah, Danny really likes buying one of everything. I've never... I just like getting things yeah. every time. I like stacking mine up if I can. And I just use all my fighting, so I can't do the mercenary. Yep. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to buy an extra champion. So a champion for me is three. So I'll spend uh, two gold, one magic to make three. Buy a second champion. Then I feel like I should... Maybe I need to... The problem is, is the, the numbers I don't have are not the numbers I need. That's the thing. Um, I will take a knight. I'll take that upgraded knight. How much is he? Three plus one. Yeah. So I need a four. All right. So that's my last gold. I'll spend all my magic. I'll get an upgraded knight because we've rolled sixes. Quite a bit. Fair amount. Okay. Your knights. It's nice with all your fives. Lost. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Fine. Okay. Five first. So I get three gold for my three peasants. Mm -hmm. Twos, I have no twos, and seven. So it's your turn. I get two of magic or two coins. I'll take two magic. Got a nice stack of money. Yeah. Oh, and seven. Eh, eh, I'll take your magic. All right. There's not a lot of take that in this game. There's just a couple cards that you steal or take from somebody. It's one of the few. Okay. Not quite. Yeah. Eight, just gold. Mm. I'm gonna buy a domain. Mm. And these symbols too account for the symbols on your Duke card. Yeah. So like I'm trying to collect these symbols, so if I buy a domain, those symbols can count too. Um, They're just pricey. Okay. That is kind of good. Um, during your action phase, which is buying stuff, you get an extra, or gain a gold, or gain a magic when you buy a citizen. That's not bad. During your action phase, slay a monster, get an extra magic. And then during your roll phase, you may pay one one gold per holy citizen and turn a turn a die to a five or a five or you turn it to a one. So you can turn it to purposely get the cleric. You have I'm to spend gold one. though. Yeah. Three, six, seven, eight. One, two. Oh, that's only six. 
Which one? This oh, one. Oh, yeah. Oh, you, wait, no. You pointed that, at that one. Oh, yeah, that's right. That was nine. This six. Six and three. Six and four. That's ten. Well, yeah. yeah. Okay. That's why I'm telling that. All right, so remember, you have, so you might get an extra turn, or an extra. I get one magic each action, action, okay. action phase. All right. Uh, is that the only thing you did? Yeah. Okay. You got a second thing. Don't have any fighting. So. I think I'll just take one for my okay. second. Okay, I get three magic for the cleric. I don't have a three. I do have a four archer, so I get two military. Just converted fighting I just got to money. Yeah, it's not bad. Okay, so I'm four. I don't have a lot of resources yet. What is this one? The Baron? Five, Five. money to one victory for, for each domain. domain. Okay, well that's not gonna do any good. Okay. Um Man, kind of going the monster route, getting lots of military to fight monsters. Okay, what have I got? Three, combine it with some magic. Um, the Albear's two more magic. So I pay one magic, I get two in return. Um, if I do this for the flaming skeleton, one of each. That's three victory. Yeah, let's do that. So five for the flaming skeleton, which gives me one magic back and a money back. The death knight. Yeah. Yeah, so I just, why is it only one point though? Oh, well, because you get five magic in return. Yeah. You know, yeah, it's five. Okay, so maybe I need to diversify two. Again, some of these numbers are not what I, my Baron wants though. I'm gonna get this mercenary for three. Okay, go ahead. Just feel like I'm behind here for some reason, but <clears throat> it's hard to say. Two, okay. Eight, ten, two money. Okay, I have no twos, sixes. I get two military for my two knights and eight. eight. Convert a gold into yeah. four might for military. Nice. Oh, no, I can do that. Oh. If I had two coins, I could have done that and gotten eight military. Oh, in one turn? Yeah, because I have two, oh, wow. two champions. Yeah. If I, ah, dang it. Oh, you just never know. Yeah. Maybe I need to keep more. I need to. That's happened to me twice when I haven't been able to do that. I need to. Yeah, because I could do it twice because I had two of them. Okay. I know it's four for each time. Yeah, if it's my turn, then I get four automatically. But if it's your turn, I can I have to pay them on your turn. Mm. All right. Um, Don't forget your tower mm, domain yeah. card gives you free magic. Monolith of Ostendar. Mm. Uh, I think... Six money, so I think I'll spend two to get my second 11, 12. Okay. And I didn't realize it was four money on your turn. So. Yeah, the butcher's good on, on the opposite player's turn. And it's got plenty of magic, so seven. I'll do. I can't read it from that far. Which one? That far. Okay, you need at least one magic. Okay, um, and then five. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wait. Oh. Mm -hmm. You need a total of six. Six chips. 
Yeah. Okay, and at least two of them have to be a red and a blue. All right, and then you get two money and a magic back. Two. Okay, three. I have a mercenary, so I get a military and a money. And then a five. Ooh. I'll take two military for my fighting peasants and a gold for my regular peasant. All right. So I think I'm just going the combat route. Two, three, four, three, four five. Six, seven. We're taking out that death knight. Mm. It's only one victory point, but that's five magic. For some reason, I keep thinking about you. Have I don't even really remember the movie Night at the Museum, where the figures come to life. It sounds familiar. Uh, but... Well, the Genghis Khan feat, the Genghis Khan character in there, liked they call it magic. Oh. He liked magic, and somebody called it magic. I don't know why I've been thinking about that lately. <laughs> so I, that's all I did was fight the knight? Yeah. Okay, so... Skeleton King. I need at least one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, we're taking out the Skeleton King, too. Dang. Two times every domain. Um, that's weak. But it's four victory points. Okay, so when a pile is exhausted, two of these do something. When we reveal them, two of them do nothing. All right, Queen's Day Festival. I think you said two of them do nothing twice. Did I? Yeah. Two do nothing and two have events on them. The active player immediately gains two coins. All of the players gain one. And then we just put that when four piles are gone. So you can kind of, usually these citizen piles never go out. But it's usually the monsters, domains. These do not count here. These were an afterthought expansion, these agents. Um, I think one reason they made these is because sometimes I know people are complaining that you get all these resources, you need to have stacks, but you didn't really need to buy anything. So they put they put in cards that forced you uh, to spend stuff, right? Um, so we go until four piles are exhausted. All right, so I did one thing. You did two. Did I? Yeah, you bought, you killed. Oh, I killed two, two monsters, you're right. Ooh, two. five peasants for three. Mm -hmm. I have no two. And eight. Oh! Two coins to get eight oh. military. Two, three, four, five. That's seven. Six, seven, eight. It's what? Seven, not eight. No, I want it to be... <laughs> Dang it, I want it to be eight. So I only get two magic or two coins. Dang it. I'm going to steal those magic from you. <sighs> uh, <laughs> man, now I'm double bummed because I missed eight military and now you all stole all my magic. All right. Well, boo. Now I get another magic. Mm, yeah, take all the magic you want. <laughs> yeah, now that she's got so much gold, she might as well start looking at some of these other things. What does that mean? Can you change the um, things? During your rural phase, you may change one die to a... You may, you may reduce it by one. Oh. So you could, after you roll it, you could reduce it to a four. If that, okay. if, yeah. That is four experience. Yeah, we're, there's very little dice manipulation. It's one of the few cards that you can change the dice around. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to make this one. Unless my monster fighting skills. Uh, I've got quite a few more monsters than you do. Uh, I'll buy it for 11. Okay. Okay. Uh, I still one. Yeah, we can do one more. Any of the 11s or 12s, yeah. 11, 12s, pretty rare. Like double sixes or something, yeah. Uh, I think I'll go get 
good mother. A good archer. Okay. Uh, I gotta get some. Like I said, my military is paying off. I'm hoping that that pays. Ugh. All right, three magic for me. On a one, a two, I get a coin and a military. And then a three, I have no three. I never get that. Or no, no, I don't have a two. That was my three. Sorry, that was my three. I didn't have a two. Yeah. Okay. Ugh. Okay, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pay off the publican. That's one ugly looking barmaid. All right, so five <laughs> coins. I can turn, I get a victory point for every basically lock pick. One, two, three, four. Yeah. All right, so I take four purples. So those will be victory points at the end, just straight up. Okay, so once you do an agent, you just put them under the deck. Draw another one. King's Herald. Uh, trash a citizen for two. Two victory points. And my second thing, maybe I, maybe again, I'm doing the whole wrong situation here. Nines and the ten, eleven. What do you keep getting that pays off a lot? Um, Fours? Three? Actually, I mean, I have one, three, four. You've not had the nines or nine ten. The nine tens haven't really paid off. And the eleven twelves. Well, I have a cleric. Well, we both have. Yeah. Uh, Mostly just getting one of each each time. Yeah, I know you're, you're. Yeah, you're. But it seems like you have. You've had a ton of gold. This yeah. game. Um, I don't know how. Yeah. All right. Um, I will pay. Four, two and two uh, to get another mercenary. I'm gonna try doubling up because if they pay off. Okay, all right. Eight. There's the nine we were just talking about. Mm -hmm. All right, knights for six, three. Ooh, look at me. I can turn two military because I have two mercenaries, one each, nice. two gold each. So I just made four gold off my mercenaries. And then you made your priestess, actually. We were just talking about the nines. Did Eight. you get your nine? Yeah. Okay. All right. Um, I'm going to fight something. Those are horrible. Uh, I need six total for that. I'll do three of each. Okay. This. I get... Gold and a magic rack. And don't forget your domains. Oh yeah, and magic. And I could reduce it if I wanted. Yeah, you could make it an eight. You could have made it. It's too late now. You're supposed to do it yeah. before you start. Could have made it eight. I would have made four. I would have made eight military. I'll put this up here to remember. Okay. Did you do two? Yeah. Okay. Okay, knights. Because even my champion on uh, my turn is just straight four. I don't have to pay them. Yeah. One, I get three magic. <clears throat> That'll be good. And then seven. I'll steal three magic from you. For my thief. Yeah, that wasn't a bad turn. That wasn't a bad turn. Okay. So let's keep fighting. Do I have enough to get that golden golem? Wow. So that's three magic. Do Ooh, I have enough? Seven. Four I and then seven. One. Yeah. Okay, so I'm taking, yeah, that's all my military. I'm using the magic to combine that. There's the straight magic, but that gives me five gold in return. Nice. Three, four, five. That's four points. And then it's four victory points, yeah. Ooh. All right, so there's that. That's One, two, seven three, four. Victory. Yeah. It's eight. 18 resources though. Mm. Yeah. And then you get three times for every, uh, whatever 
domain or swamp or whatever that is. Oh, he should be on the very bottom. Oh. He should be on the very bottom. You put the put the decreasing or increasing difficulty. Yeah, he should be on the very bottom. Uh -huh. All right, so I'm gonna do four, five. Is that exactly five? All right, I'm gonna go broke. Mm. I'm gonna pay the treasurer ten coins to get five victory points. Just trying to save yourself. Uh, give me one more purple. Okay, so the new one is the assassin. Pay three to flip a citizen from a player. You can basically turn one of over, turn over one of mine. So you can't use it. So I can't use it. Um, yeah. Okay. Nice with your eight. So now I'm broke, but I'm hoping my straight up victory with all my monsters, because I've got quite a few monsters for victory points. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, you've got a fair amount. Okay. Mm -hmm. We need to start diminishing these piles. Okay, Ugh. my mercenary pay one military for two gold <laughs> twice, because there's threes, and then six. And then six. <laughs> oh, but I just got that. Then I can pay the mercenary yes. to get four gold. All right, doesn't really matter which order, so it wasn't horrible, I guess. Is your symbols you're trying. Mm. Okay, I'll do it. Okay. At least one, so that's eight and nine. What's your reward? Um, during your roll phase, you may pay two coins to make. The dice is six. Okay. All right, so there's a blank exhausted. Right. Okay. Pretty sure I only okay. did one time. Four, four, so the fours pay off twice, so I get two and two, so four. And then eight. Oh! Oh! So I got four, I just got 12 fighting in one. Four. And four. Woo! My military strength is off the chain. Yeah, something like that. Okay. All right. So, do I expose that red dragon for you to possibly? Uh, you have no military. Oh, just oh. because you have a lot doesn't mean that mine is minuscule. Yeah. Do any of these dork down here need military payoffs? Not really. Uh, I don't have any magic, so I can't, I can't even do the dragon can. I don't even have any magic. All right, so. You might have 12. Oh, what? Well, you not, need one of each. I need, I need at least one magic. Can I get a magic? Oh, yes, I can. Well, if I fight the owlbear, I'm going to be probably. Yeah. I just got 12 military. Oh, but I need. Yeah. Okay, so let's do four. I'll fight the owlbear. I don't want to do the math, so I'll just do this. Okay, so I need... Oh, I need at least six magic. There's I can't substitute magic. Okay. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. Well, I had 12, so I'll get that giant. I should have done that math, because that's eight. Um, I get a gold... I'm just hoping that fighting is paying off for me at the end. Okay. What's that mean? What's that? What does that mean? Seder mage. Like the reward. Oh, five of anything. It's wild. Oh. Okay. I think some of these monsters came in a, an expansion. I bought, I'll put, a, I'll put all the expansions I bought. There's like six. I think the expansion added some of these. Mm -hmm. Um... I'm not sure if that's five of anything or, or well, I know it's five of wild, but um, I'm trying Just to think. Money or yeah, I don't know if you can things. split it up. Yeah. Um, 
Oh yeah, because there's extra monsters in here we're not supposed to use. Hmm. Oh, because we don't have these um, oh, areas where they yeah. live or whatever. I don't know. I think I had to buy another expansion for that. For habitats. Their habitats, yeah. Um, it's the agent one. Okay. Um, one resource of your choice. So it's oh. five of it. Five of whatever you want. Okay. My turn? Yeah. Wait, did. Oh, yeah, because I did the two fights, yeah. Okay. Two. two no. Uh, Five gives me three gold for the peasants. Oh, that's seven. Two magic for the thief. Uh, five. I think the math is seven is the most common number. If you roll two, two six dice, seven is the most common number you can get. I think I read oh, somewhere that once. Makes sense. Yeah. But that's six, seven. That's nine. So I think I'm gonna get the this one. Yeah. Okay. You can just match up the pile heights. Okay, so you get three magic and three money in return. The first thing. And then that's a gold. Yeah, I don't that much. Eight. I don't think buy either of those domains. If you slay a monster, you get magic. For the violet thorn. Mm, I'll immediately turn three magic to three victory. Not bad. Sure. Six. Mm. Okay, fives. I'll take two military for my dudes and one for my regular peasant. So on fives. Oh, five. Five, and then six. Um, my upgraded knight. I'll take a magic <gasps> for my upgraded. Finally. And then 11, yeah. Oh, I get eight money. You get eight money? Because I have two butchers. Well, yeah. a butcher and a miner, and they both. Oh, have. yeah. You're right. Eight money. Four. Okay. Um... Okay. What's that one? Uh, immediately gain whatever holy oh, symbol. Holy sin, symbol citizen from the center stacks. Five, six, seven. I'll take that. It's three points, and then I get a holy dude. Mm -hmm. uh, um, well, I'll take this priestess just in case. Okay, so that's pretty much done. I'm just going to set it over here since it's done. Okay. Is that all? Did I just... Is that Woodburn? Did I just do one? Uh, yeah, that was... Only, I only did one uh, thing. Yeah. Okay. Um, I really want to kind of save up, save up my military now. I'll just take take a resource. Okay. So Did you roll? Yeah. Was that a real roll? Yes. Okay. Archer for four. One is the cleric. And then five. I get three gold for my peasants. Four. Yes. And then five. Jeez. Okay. Total resources, okay. yeah, you're not even close. Five. Yeah, that's yeah, you're not even close. 
your money is the only thing you've got a lot of. So again, you can kind of force start forcing it again just by buying that. It's gonna, yeah. you know, we're one step closer to the end. Two. Yeah, nice. we're kind of dragging out. Or yeah. For each domain, I have four domains. Yeah, three money. Five money. All five. five. Okay, it just goes underneath just in case. Oh. And then I get four. And then the Huntress, take a random monster from somebody, then that player gains one victory point. So that could go really swingy. Uh -huh. I could steal a five point victory monster from you. <clears throat> Don't you have a couple strong ones in there? What's that? Do you have a couple? Uh, I've got a few. Three, four, four, three. Yeah, they're not all that powerful because I've gotten powerful rewards from them. I don't even have a G at the end of his dragon kin, not king. Kin. Dragon kin. Means kin is like your family. Uh. Oh, I don't even have to pay the huntress. Okay. Come on, oh, eight. All right, three magic from the cleric. The three, uh, I get two and two because I have two mercenaries. Okay, that's not bad. And then four. Ooh, I get two more military for my archer. Dragon, we're racing for the dragon. Two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I'm two away. Okay. I could do it if I had two, two more, two more of something. Okay, so um the alchemist is up let's buy the alchemist for three so it just cost me three gold for the alchemist um kind of want to assassinate now so i guess yeah all right so shuffle those monsters up you get one victory point i give yeah you get a are we out of purples yeah I didn't think we'd need them. No, we need it on the other side of the Okay, so yeah, it says um, take a random monster from somebody that player gains one. And I got a three. All right. And I was in the middle. The Brute Squad. Ten gold. Gain a citizen. And then take a citizen or just banish the citizen from the top. Yeah, that seems pretty pricey for not a big reward. Really, yeah. 10 gold for one citizen. one citizen, then get rid of a citizen. Okay. Yeah. Um, is that the only thing I did? Was your. No, I bought the alchemist. Yeah. Okay. Six. Okay, six. I get two military. I get three. And then a four, I get one more military. And then, nine. And then a ten. Ooh, priestess. Oh, nice. Priestess, one magic for three military on your turn. Not bad. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Six, eight, ten, eleven. Yeah, you can do it. You just need 14, eight. 15, 16, 18. All right. So you get three gold for each monster you've already fought that has that symbol on it, including that one. So that's pretty good. One, two, three. So you get nine gold. Nice. All right. There's them exhausted. Dang it. That's the trouble of buying those, fighting those cards. All right. 
twos. I have no two. Four is an archer for me. Yeah, I would have I would have gotten that this turn. Dang it. And then six, two more military. Where's the guys that need ten military for five points? Oh, is that one? Is yeah. that red? Oh, okay. So we'll pay. <laughs> I can't see. Well, it's really game. dark. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten for five victories. Did you really get that one with the money? The agent did use money for a victory? Yeah. I think I did. I think I paid them off, yeah. Okay. I'm just hoping that this, this because each one of these is a victory point, I'm just hoping that offsets. Okay, so if I, what's that one, eight or eight. six? Eight. Four, so I could end the game right now by buying this one right here. Yeah, yeah let's go ahead. It's kind of dragging out, two. Plus you're gaining lots of crap. All right, oh, not military, I need... Okay. Um, immediately gain three military. And a citizen, a helmet citizen of two or less. Is that possible? Yeah, okay. I got three. All right. All right, so that'll end the game. This has an event on it. Because I just know two of them. Yeah. Uh, during any roll phase... When doubles are played, all players lose one of each resource. That won't matter. Yeah. Okay. So, do you have your, oh, yeah. I don't know where my phone is at. Okay. All right. So flip over your Duke. Let's see. We'll show. So this is how you tally points. So her Duke says two victory points times each monster. Okay. So let's figure out that now. So each monster you've slain. Okay, so you get 12 points for that. Okay, and then each monster that has this symbol on it, I don't... Yeah, one. Yeah. Okay, that's one point. So you, you have, yeah, I love this guy. Hrothgar the Conqueror, you should have been fighting monsters like crazy. Yeah, really, yeah see, you should, have, you should have been, you should have been buying up military citizens. Okay. Mm -hmm. Then it says she gets one point for every four resources. So go ahead and put yours thing. So are the purples. So just put stacks of four. Every four resources you get a victory point. That's three. Oh, that's four. Doesn't matter. Every every four victory points. Okay. The six. Oh, no, I'm sorry, you're right. It's, yeah, you have to make. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, and then your domains, I each have victories. Mm, that's nine. nine. And then your oh, monsters. Plus four. Okay, and then your monsters. We always forget to add the victory points for monsters. So Here, I'll read them off. Uh, that's 14, 16, 18, 19. Okay, and then each one of those. Yeah. Okay, it's not very high. What'd you get? 58. 58, okay, here we go with mine. You so, got a lot of victory points just in Yeah. There. All right, so mine was um, one for each helmet citizen. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So six there. Two for every lockpick ones. So two, four, six, I think I'm going to, uh, eight, ten, twelve. Okay, then I get one point for every three resources. Did we match them up to be the same? We didn't, like, over... I don't think we over... Like, okay, yeah. as long as we're consistent, I can't remember. All right, so four more points there. Okay, so that's my dude. I'm just your monsters. Okay, so uh, three for the domain. Only one. Huh? Only one. Yeah, domain. only about one domain. Okay, so six. 
um, eight, five, uh, another five, and then seven, mm -hmm. three, there's five there, 10, 10 total, in that? 10, 14. Did you screw it up? No. Okay. You got 70. Yeah. Well, that victory saved you. Yeah, all of these. Yeah. But yeah, you should, yeah, you, yeah. Monsters too. You should have been slain. You should have, yeah. You should have, because when I've gotten that guy before, I go like knights, mercenaries, warlords. I go anything that gives me military so I can just slaughter through those guys, mm -hmm. monsters. But I feel like if I don't have one of each, then I'm not really gaining that much each time you roll. Well, it's risky. Yes, it's risky because again, it's you have to come back to the rolls of the of the dice, of course. That's why. But but when that, I mean, I had a couple times where I got if I had had the warlord, few I would have had even more military. Yeah. I think you could have focused a little bit more on spending your gold here once you started getting those stacks of gold. But, yeah, uh, but by that time, then... By that was, time, it was close to the end. And none of them were really that good. But that's why I started going for these agents, because I knew I wasn't going to get it with... Um, so, I, yeah, I was hope, yeah, I was, alone. yeah, I was, I was going for monsters and whatever victory points I could get, get from there. All right, so that's, uh, again, uh, Card Kingdoms of Valeria. I don't have any... There's a whole bunch of Valeria games. This is the only one that I have. This is the only one I've kind of been interested in. It's just kind of fun to pull this one out and just roll some dice and try and get some victory points. You can't really, you can plan a little bit, like I said, with your monster Baron yeah. or Duke or whatever. You can kind of plan a little bit, but um, yeah, it still comes down to the die rolls because there's lots where you were just blowing me away with resources, but yeah. I was smart with my resources and my investments. <laughs> All right, so thanks for joining us again, and we will see you next time. Bye-bye.